Hello students. Today we are going to do exercise 4.4. But before doing the exercise we will do properties of multiplication on page number 40, 86 sorry on page number 86. First property. See children I have given some examples here. I will write accordingly. See 1 0 za 0 2 0 za 0 3 0 za 0 4 0 za 0 5 0 za 0 6 0 za 0 this all you are doing in your table also when you start speaking the table the first thing you say is something multiplied by 0 means 1 0 za 0 2 0 za 0 3 0 za 0 4 0 za 0 like this 10 0 za 0 now if you will reverse the order, reverse the order means if you will write 0 in the first place and this on the second place. Then also the product remains the C. 0 1s are 0, 0 2s are 0, 0 3s are 0, 0 4s are 0 and in the same way till 0 10s are we will get the product 0 only. From this example we concluded that when we multiply a number with 0, the answer is always 0, even after changing the order. Means, whenever we are multiplying 0 with a number, the answer is always 0, the product is always 0. And when you change the order also, then also it remains the same. Something multiplied by 0 is always 0. Now, move on to the next property here. Here also I have written the uh, way that how you can remember this. See, 1, 1, za, 1, 2, 1, za, 2, 3, 1, za, 3, 4, 1, za, 4 and in the same way when you will do it till 10, 10, 1, za, 10. Now here in this column I have reversed the order means the 1 I have written in the first place and the other number I have written in second place. Now 1 10s are 10, 1 9s are 9, 1 8s are 8, 1 7s are 7 and in the same way when we will go up we will get the number with which we are multiplying 1. See here whenever we are multiplying a number with 1 we are getting the same number. 2 multiply by 1, the same number 2. 3 multiply by 1, the same number 3. So from here, we conclu concluded that when we multiply a number with 1, the product is always the number itself. Means whatever number we are multiplying it with, we are getting the same number. The product remains the same even after changing the order also. Like here I have changed the order. The product is always same. 10 ones are 10. 1 tens is also 10. Okay students. So first property is something multiplied by 0 is 0. And something multiplied by 1 means the number itself. Now the third property from the previous two properties, we had concluded that when we multiply two numbers, the product remains the same when we change the order also. Here I have taken an example, 4 multiplied by 5 is 20. But when I write 5 and 4 in the interchanged places, means 5 I have written first and 4 I have written in second place, then also the product remains the same, 20 and here also 20. 5 fours are 20 and 4 5 is also 20. So third property is when two numbers we are multiplying in any order the product or answer remains the same. Now fourth property when we multiply three numbers we can put them in any order the product remains the same. Now see how you will do it. See I have taken an example of 2 5 and 3 here. Now I have two cases here, 2 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 3 and in the second case I have taken 3 in the first place, 2 in the second place and 5 in the third place. Now 
we will multiply both these numbers sorry both these cases and see is the product remain same so let us see the first case 2 and 5 will multiply first 2 fives are 10 then multiplied by 3 10 threes are 30 now 3 and 2 will multiply first 3 twos are 6 and then 5 6 fives are 30 here you see both the answers are same mean when we are taking three numbers also then also the product remains same when we change the order also now let us write exercise 4.4 in the copy write the date exercise 4.4 question is write the correct number in the box now see i have written selected questions here and rest of the questions you have to do yourself like you have to use the properties here 103 multiplied by 2 is equal to dash multiplied by 103 now here the product remains the same even we change the order this property we have to use now 103 is in this side and in this side too but 2 is missing in this side so we have to write 2 here answer is 2 now here we have three numbers and when we change the order of those numbers the product remains the same here 19 and 450 are in one group but one number is missing here that is 1 so we'll write 1 in the missing number now something multiplied by 0 is always 0 here we have the last one property that when we multiply three numbers the order can be changed but the product remains the same here we have 8 but we have two numbers which are missing two numbers are 113 and 5 now the last one is something multiplied by 1 the answer is always the number itself here the number is 784 now c d g i and j these are the homework